All right, I think I'm filming, and I think both cameras are on me. I'm not sure what's going on here, but uh, this is kind of an impromptu video, and I wanted to talk about a strobe light. And this strobe here is a Schmick. I'm not sure how it's pronounced. It's S Y M I K, Schmick, Schmick, Symick. You pronounce it however you want to pronounce it. But anyway, it's a little strobe, and most of you know that I like little portable strobes. And uh, I like them because you can charge the uh, batteries up on them, stick them on, and go. You don't have to carry a battery pack and so forth. Uh, this little unit here, uh, it's the larger, the, the GS600 uh, unit, which has a lot more lights on it, and it's a bright light, and it goes up to... Uh, 3.7 miles and it compares pretty much to uh, an ARC-5 unit and uh, I've got an ARC-5 unit coming as well and it'll be here soon and uh, the reason I uh, purchased two of these little uh, they're basically drone strobe lights but they're really bright and uh, the reason uh, I purchased them is because they have green and red and white on the same unit. And so I purchased two of them because I wanted a green on one side and a, and a red on the other side that were bright. Uh, it's got a USB charger on it and it uses a USB-C uh, cable. Uh, it also comes with some Velcro connections if you want to connect it with Velcro or double-sided 3M tape. Get several of those. So anyway, I know that everybody's sitting here wanting to see how bright this thing is. And you know, it, it really, it's hard to demonstrate a strobe light on cameras because um, they're just, they're either so bright that they just flash and it, you know, you can't really tell much. And it has different modes. And that's the white uh, strobe right there. And, uh, I don't know if I aim it down, if it, if it helps, you know, by flashing off the blue or just aiming right at the cameras. But it is bright. You can't look at it. It's so bright. And uh, you can go into strobe mode. You can go into like a flash mode so that it just flashes slowly. You push it again. You can go to green. And I don't know if the cameras are picking that up, but it's a bright green. Uh, try to aim it down so maybe you'll see it, but it's a bright, bright green. And that way you can put one on one side, a green, and we'll go to we'll go to red. It also will flash slower in that green as well. And probably on film it's or video you're seeing, it probably doesn't look that green, but trust me, it's very bright green. And here's your red. So it usually charges about an hour and a half to, to charge the larger one. You can get a smaller one that charges about 45 minutes. And... Uh, once it's fully charged, three to six hours, depending on what mode you put it on. And you can put the charge the battery up and set it out there for 12 months and it'll maintain its charge. And the battery is a 3.7, 500 milliamp battery. And once again, USB-C. And we'll change it again there's the slow red flash and we're back to white here we've got a hunter strobe and I've got a guardian angel strobe and we'll see if we can try to compare these. This is the Guardian Angel. See if 
if I can find a way to show that one. Try to spin it around. This is the hunter strobe beside it here. Turn the guardian off. This is the hunter. This little one here, it is bright. It is hard to look at. And you know when you put them, turn them all on, it it might be hard to tell that this little one here is this new one, this Simic. Uh, but it blinks so fast and so bright, it's just. Where the other ones are slower and it tends to, you know, they stay on. Maybe if I turn this one on to the second level here. Like, right, if I make it slower, you can see it a lot brighter because it comes on slow. But I mean, it's so quick. It just, I mean, it's a flash, just a brilliant flash. So, anyway. You be the judge, you decide. I've got two of them. Uh, one will be green, one will be red. Um, but this is what I'm expecting to use it as, a red and a green. And once again, if you wanna go to white, two whites. They're in plastic cases that seem pretty strong. I don't know that they're scratch resistant, but most of you guys take care of your units and don't scratch things. So Anyway, that's the Hunter Strobe, the Guardian Angel, and uh, Firehouse Arc 5 is what I'm going to get in next. I have a Firehouse a small firehouse that I put on my helmet, probably replace it with the Arc 5, which is supposed to be even brighter than these. 3.7 miles uh, distance. You can get them all on Amazon. Well, at least these you can get on Amazon. The Hunter Strobe you want to get from Chip Hunter. Guardian Angel, you can go out to Guardian Angel and get it. I'll have a link for all of these in case you want those or one of these or to do some more research on them. So that'll wrap it up. We'll get this out. I know there's people that ask about different strobes and uh, I test them just to see what they're like. It's kind of my thing. It's what I like to do. At least if you don't like them, you can knock them off your list and find something else. Thanks for watching.